What's up guys, it's Shane back here with another video. Today we're gonna look at an app called Bypass. Bypass was made by HMD, which is Help Me Devon. If you don't know Devon Terrell, he is a super cool dude. I don't care what nobody says. This man has helped me with a ton of stuff. He's done a ton for the community. He is a artist, uh, an engineer, a mixing engineer, recording engineer, app developer. This man literally does everything. So we're gonna look at this plugin, it's called Bypass. It is to help get rid of on, unwanted and unneeded plugins in your DAW, on your computer. We're gonna get it all cleaned up and show you what it looks like. Real quick, let me take a second to tell you to please subscribe, like, and comment to the channel. Turn on the notifications so that you know when I go live or so you know that uh, when I drop another video because this is what helps me keep putting y'all on game and it'd be much appreciated. Love y'all, let's get back to the video. So on my computer here, we have this app down here at the bottom. It is called Bypass. This is what it looks like. I have put it on my dock. We're gonna pull it up. The interface of it is super simple, super clean. Bypass, scan. What it's gonna do is scan through your computer. We're gonna click it. It's pretty fast. It's gonna go through all the plugins and everything on your computer that you have currently downloaded. And we are going to pick something to delete just so I can show you. But before that, we're gonna pull up Pro Tools and actually look at a specific plugin that I want to get rid of. Now I'm not gonna go through and delete a ton of plugins just because I don't want to, but I have one that I'm, I'm, I'm wanting to delete. And we're just gonna go down here to Universal Audio. And for a lot of people, Universal Audio, if you buy a couple plugins or you have a Apollo interface, you're gonna have all these plugins and you probably only use a few of them. Uh, but I'm just going to pick one to delete. I'm going to go with this UAD Vertigo VSC2, right? Let's just say that's a plugin I don't care about, I don't want, and I no longer want to see in Pro Tools, right? So let's close Pro Tools. We're going to quit. And we're going to go back to Bypass. Here in Bypass, we're going to look up that plugin. Let's look up Vertigo, and here it is right here. So we're gonna click this and this, since this is associated, this is the mono version. I believe that's what the M stands for. But we're gonna click these two here, and we are going to delete. It's gonna ask you if you wanna delete the following plugins. If you're wondering why there's multiple different ones, it's just because these are different, uh, different audio like versions of the plugin. So you got the VST3, VST, AU, AAX, and VST versions, just different versions of the plugin, but it's all the same thing. We're gonna delete, put in your computer password, at least that's what mine is making me do. Okay, it's gonna rescan, so it's not gonna be in there when it rescans, but what we're gonna do is pull up that same session and you want to make sure a funny instance happened to me earlier where I was doing it and I did not close Pro Tools. <laughs> Shout out to Devon for helping me with that. But you want to make sure to close Pro Tools and then reopen it so that it will be gone in your doll. And as it's pulling up, we wait. This is a super cool thing, man. This is much needed. Uh, a, lot of, a lot of engineers need this. A lot of producers, a lot of uh, artists that record themselves at home. But we're going to go here. Let's look up the plugin, Universal Audio. And as you can see, it is gone and out of my DAW. If for some reason you wanted it back, you can go to the website of whatever plugin company and go back in there, find it, and re download. But, you know, if you've got a bunch of plugins that you're trying to get rid of, this is the way to do it. This is the simplest way. The old way would be go through folders and your computer and all that and try to figure out where everything is and then delete it from there. So no more doing that. We have handy dandy bypass by HMD. 
And yeah, this is a game changer. Shout out to you guys, man, for watching. Every engineer needs this bypass app. You can get it from Help Me Devon's website. I can drop a, uh, a link in the description. And uh, yeah, I just wanted to say this, a quick, easy, simple tutorial of, on, on, of how to use this. And it's helped me a lot. So appreciate you guys. Peace, and I'll catch you on the next video.